Hello everybody, my name is Vigny Swarin. I am going to present you a tool called Galita, which is available in Backtrack. Okay, so first of all, let us go to the presentation of Galita. So as we can see here, the uh, Galita is actually an Internet Explorer cookie forensic analysis tool. Galita's main purpose is to reconstruct the Internet Explorer cookie file, which is not in a non, which is not in a human readable form. Where the information stored in the cookie file by IE is actually doesn't make sense to the investigator. Furthermore, the cookie file in the Internet Explorer cookie file are actually not organized and it is the informations are here and there. So the solution for these problems is to use Galita. So Galita is a tool which helps the investigator to decrypt the cookie.txt file and output it to another txt or any other file format that is preferable by the investigator. This means that when an investigator got a laptop of an attacker or a criminal, he can actually go to the cookie file in the Internet Explorer, get all the cookies and then run them through Galita. This can result to a very organized and a very well versed information from the Internet Explorer cookie file. And the cookie file, the, I'm sorry, the Galata version 1.0 can run in Windows, but it has to be executed through SIGWIN, Mac OS X, Linux, and other BSD platforms. So these are the screenshot of the command for Galata. There is only one command for Galata. It is Galata option file name, which is the file of the cookie file, and then the file where do you want to output the of uh, the result of the of the decryption. So first of all, let us go to the demo. I will show you how to get the cookie file from the Internet Explorer cookies and then run it in Backtrack. So first of all, we open our Internet Explorer. So this is a new version of Internet Explorer, IE8. So we go to the options and we go to Internet options. Okay, once we have seen the Internet options, we go to browsing history and go to settings. Here is where all the history and the cookies will be kept. So here temporary internet files and history settings. So you click on view files. It will direct you to the temporary internet files which is available which has been browsed through Internet Explorer. So there are many files here, picture files and all that. So you just have to scroll down until you see cookies. So these are the list of cookies which is available and has been browsed through Internet Explorer by the by me, by myself. So these are all the cookies. So if you open the cookies, okay, you would see that the information are in numbers, but only the website which has been browsed is available whether the other informations are in numbers so this does not help the investigator to know when did the attacker or the criminal went to the page and when did they log out and all sort of things so by using Galita you can actually decrypt this information to a human readable information so that the investigator can get a clear information on what is happening what has been done in the criminal's laptop so we close this so what I suggest you to do I'm going to save some of the files from this cookie files in my pen drive and I will run them through my backtrack which is in VM player so you just have to copy some of them in your pen drive and then run it to VM player so now we are going to let me close this first go into the backtrack okay in backtrack you can see that I have three cookie files here three cookie files which I have been exported from Internet Explorer so now I'm going to run one of these cookie files and show you what are the information behind that before that let me open to you and show so just click display so here it will be opened in get edit so here you can see that the information is not it's the same like what we saw in the windows where only the information of the website is clear but others are not in alphabet others are in numbers which cannot be interpreted by the investigator so we close this 
we open a terminal so in terminal if you want to see whether your terminal got Galeta or not you type Galeta and if this appears that means you have Galeta in your backtrack alright now let us run the command for the Galeta so you first you type the name Galeta then use redirect the Galeta where is your cookie file is so mine is in root under desktop and then I can put this name of the text file which is the original cookie file so let me save the time so I click rename I copy then I paste then I add .txt so I have already got the original cookie file where Galita can find it and I put a more 266 sign and then I write where do I want to output the result of this decryption process so I will just type root desktop which is the same place as the cookie file but I will change the name of the file which is test galeta.txt actually you can give any other name that you like but I will put this here so I just want you to view at this point where you can see the new file test galeta.txt will be generated once I click enter so I hit enter okay now you can see that the test galeta.txt has already appeared so what I will do I will open this file and here you can see the complete information about the cookie file which is not decrypted before and this one is the de encrypt, uh, de decrypted one so you can see that the site is smartdraw.com and the site has been accessed on 2nd of February 2012 time is 6 12 44 seconds in the evening so these are the information which can be used by the investigator to place or to see when and where did the attacker actually browse through this website so these are the only simple process which is using Galeta you can see here this is the original file which I have decrypted and these are the result of the particular file if you want a clear view of this file you can also run this file through any other spreadsheets such as Excel or you can see in the backtrack you can use GNU Merix where you can install it and then you can run this file in GNU Merix where it will show you in a table form about this information where you can see a more organized information regarding this cookie file so basically that is all about regarding Galeta and how to use it so I hope that this tutorial uh, gives information to you how to have a forensically sound investigation on using Galeta running the Internet Explorer cookie file in it. So that is all my presentation. Thank you very much for listening.